Okay, so now I'm gonna go e4, controlling central squares again. And now I have full control of, of the center. So it's trying to take control of the center by playing d5, but okay, takes, I go here. Now it's targeting this pawn, so I wanna develop my piece and protect the pawn at the same time. And also, okay, so now it's threatening my bishop. So I can push, I can also play here. So if he goes there, here, takes, I can take here and then take here. So he's losing a queen right here. This is uh, something I knew. I guess he's going to might resign right now. Okay, I took. And here basically never resigned, so I just uh, talked with myself for a few seconds. So basically, I want to control most of these squares. I'm going to start here. Develop most of my pieces here. I can take why not. I'm just gonna take see if he takes with the queen I win a time right here So I have one piece developed with black. I have two pieces developed but I'm Five that would be a nice move if takes I can take with the queen right and exchange uh, Now he pushes away my knight. I want to go forward and go here, which is protected by this pawn. And I also intend to develop my bishop here and target this pawn. Okay, now if I play here, the problem that he's gonna take this knight, pawn takes, and queen takes, and I'm just gonna lose a pawn. So I'm gonna protect this knight. Okay, if I take with pawn, it's gonna take my queen and go there. Oh, sorry, that was my bad. Okay, he, he takes here, go there. He has to move this knight. He can go here, I guess, which is a bit annoying. But then this is weak. I can go there. Mm, and uh, let's try this. I could also take with this bishop. Let's play simple, yeah? There's two choices. Let's play simple, yeah? Keep the queen. I'm targeting this queen. I could go there and attack this pawn, yeah? The only way, I mean, you can protect it via two ways. You can play here, which is, I think it's a bad move, yeah? Now I wanna take, I could take, could also take, yeah, I'm just gonna keep the bishop pair. I'm gonna take here. I could destroy his pawn structure as well, but I'm not going to do, oh, I forgot about this pawn actually. No, I made a mistake here. Okay, so let me think. Do I want to do something? I want to protect this pawn and I want to consolidate the center. So I'm going to go bishop e7 first and go play with c6 and the bishop pair. I could also play with c5. It's a possibility, right? And now that he goes here, I really want to play c5. I don't want to give him any of this. So his plan, you need to know what he's playing for. Okay, I'm going to castle first better be safe he might try this okay i'm gonna go there if he goes there remember he's attacking this pawn but i'm probably gonna take this uh, this one okay now i can take it take it and take i win a pawn i think yeah because when he takes back i can take back i win pawns and this is another pawn so i'm two pawns up now which is pretty good pretty good not gonna lie Okay, now my plan is to bring this bishop on this diagonal. I'm gonna go there, might go there, I guess, to protect against checkmate. I'm just gonna take and go for this uh, winning endgame. I'm gonna place my rook here and start slowly push the pawn to queen. Maybe bring the bishop here so that it pushes like this, you know easily and control the square for the the okay now i can play here also i'm also targeting this pawn okay i'm gonna also take this pawn so now i'm three pawns up and okay i have this uh, structure okay i'm gonna consolidate of course my play here which is, would be a good move if it goes there but it didn't now i prevent this move and i'm very happy Okay, now I'm gonna attack this pawn. He has to push if he doesn't wanna get taken. And I will place my bishop here and try and push these ones, yeah? So how am I gonna do this? I'm gonna place a rook here and then I'm gonna start pushing simply, I think, like this. 
His king cannot move him. He has to stay here. So I could also bring my king. I think it's a good lesson. Um, place your king in the best place possible. Yeah. And I think the best square for the king is to go there, basically. Okay, but I have no time, so I'm gonna be a bit faster, yeah? I'm gonna be a bit faster. I'm gonna go there and start pushing these pawns. There's nothing you can do about it. It's over, basically, here and here. And now we start pushing. I'm gonna have two pass pawn. I could have traded also. So, oh, everything is good, of course. Okay, I'm gonna push my pawns again. Again here. Check, one check. He doesn't have uh, this check, you see. Okay, and now I can push either two. Can take this pawn, I guess, but it's already over. Check, he goes there, checkmate. All right, so. Let's uh, rematch this guy with white this time. So again, we see that he likes to bring his queen early, but it's not very good because he loses the tempo. And he plays here. Now I'm gonna go d4 and develop my pieces as fast as I can. Not only am I pushing the, the center and controlling more squares. Oh, now he's threatening this. So do I, have, do I need to be careful about this? It's the question. How do I deal with this? I would sacrifice the pawn, but I don't, uh, I don't think it's a good example. So I'm gonna bring my bishop here. It feels very weird, because he might bring this bishop here also. Okay, I'm gonna... Uh, what am I gonna do here? Okay, I'm just gonna attack the queen here. And I don't want an exchange, I wanna play maybe f3. I could, uh, I'm just gonna ignore this. Oh, now I have this move, I guess. Yeah, because I'm attacking this and he has to keep protection of this bishop. So to keep protection, he has to find one of these three squares. Yeah, this is not very good, yeah? Because this gives the, the well, the queen. So not only did this guy never resign, but uh, okay, I checkmated him and uh, he sent me this. Okay, so same principle. We want to control as much of the central squares. So let's start with uh, controlling here. Might go there, of course, but it doesn't. Okay, I'm going there, controlling more of the central square. Now I want to overprotect this pawn because it was threatened. I'm going to push away this bishop because I don't want to be pinned. He might come here with the knight. I want to come back. And now, okay, is, is he going to long castle? Let's find out if he wants to take here. Okay, it does. But if he longs castle now, I open my b file, which is going to be useful for attack. And I also have the bishop pair. I'm gonna go here. Oh, actually, as d4, we could be a good move. Okay, I wanna keep this bishop so I don't have any lot of squares. The only square I can find to keep this bishop is this one. So I'm gonna bring my bishop back here. I believe this bishop is strong. Okay, so he might wanna go there. The question is do we wanna make prophylaxis? Do we wanna prevent this move? I think we do. I don't want to take here because I think my bishop is getting trapped. So I'm going to go there. Now you guys might be asking why, what's up with this bishop. It's actually going to improve, but not right now. This bishop is going to improve later on. Okay, I want to play on this file actually. This sounds weird that, that I want to play on this file. But here by taking with the rook, I prevent the move g4 because now the, the knight is hanging. And I also can try and... Hmm. How do I want to play this? Do I want to play the bishop here? Do I want to bring... Okay, first I bring this rook on the b file. Important. 
then I really need to find a good square for this queen. I think this and this could be an idea. Okay, now he's attacking my rook. So I'm gonna bring it here. He might go there also, yeah? Then I'm gonna bring it here. So two knights against two bishops. You must know that... Okay, I can push this pawn actually. He cannot take like this. He has to take like this. Yeah, okay. Um, so basically, I wanted... He made a big blunder, but basically... If he takes like this, this gives me the square for my queen to attack. So that's why I did this. But he gave me a full knight. Okay, now I want to attack this knight again. Bring back the rook and the other rook. And I'm going to attack on the file, basically. So okay, I can play this, actually. So I'm attacking the rook and the knight. It's called a fork in chess. And now, uh, basically, it's a resignable position. It still fights on. Okay, I'm attacking the knight once again. He could play here, because if I take here, he can take here. But when it goes there, I'm gonna. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna take the the rook, and then take the knight, and I have one rook and one bishop more than my opponent. It says plus eight here. Okay, so I'm gonna go be. Uh, I'm gonna go here. Target this. Might push. I don't know what it's gonna do. I'm gonna take, and I'm gonna win easily normally shouldn't be too hard let's try the rook i think he's gonna lose hope after exchanging the last rook no i thought he would not lose hope but it doesn't or he doesn't care simply okay i don't want to give anything to him i'm just gonna push this pawn i don't want to give anything <coughs> sorry any single pawn i'm just gonna push here Okay, let's exchange the queens. Let's see if he wants to exchange the queens. He doesn't want it, of course. So he might go there to protect, only moves. Or here, push, he goes there. But okay, then... I okay, again, we want to control these squares. Now, let's see if I can bring another principle. Okay, I'm going to bring my knight here. The other principle I want to talk about, um, I have to think about it, okay. So I know the main move is bishop e7, so that's what I'm going to play. If he takes, knight takes, queen takes, bishop here, I'm actually better, I think. I don't know if I should, I can castle here. Okay, I'll castle, because I don't want to uh, run into, is that, is that the free pawn? I really have no idea. I don't know enough about this theory, I guess. So I'm willing to learn. Takes, takes. Why not? Did I win any rating points? I'm wondering. Okay, I'm gonna go there. Oh, here. Takes, takes. Hmm. Okay, my idea is to play bishop here and then to attack this bishop, yeah? Or I can take, takes, and go there. Okay, I'm gonna go there and attack here. So I developed all my bishops on a, on a threatening squares. Basically, that's what you wanna do. Whenever he moves, I'm gonna take here and then take here or take here directly. So basically, it's gonna be lost for him. I can take first, but then he takes, no, he doesn't, he cannot even do this. Okay, I'm just gonna take here. He can take here, I'm gonna take there. If he takes there, I take there. So, okay. Chess is also, uh, Capablanca used to say it's 99% tactics. The rest is knowing where to put the pieces. But um, uh, the part of, about putting the pieces is very important. You cannot underestimate it. It's, it cannot be esteemed at 99%. I think it has to be some, somewhere. Like, of course, there's going to be always tactics, but if you uh, neglect the strategy, you're gonna get, get lost position all the time. Okay, so here he brings the queen. I'm gonna try an exchange, maybe. 
by playing this. Maybe he's gonna exchange the rooks, and then I'm gonna be threatening a checkmate here. Anyway, it's a piece down, so he's lost. But still, it's not because he's losing that you have to uh, uh, that you have to relax. You know, you have to keep focusing. Actually, it's one of my main weaknesses is that I relax when I'm winning, and then that's when that's when I make a blunder. Okay, so this is weak. Oh, yeah, like, I just blundered my knight. Exactly. Because I'm so relaxed right now. Okay, so at least you gave my uh, knight some life. Now I can take this pawn. I can also... So let's try to ameliorate this knight, right? This knight was a worse piece, and now I want it to be a good piece. So I want to bring the knight. He sacrifices it. I don't even want to... Uh, Acknowledge the sacrifice. I'm just gonna ignore it. I don't care. It's, it doesn't matter. I can take here, maybe. Yeah, I can take here actually. But then I, I wanna play this move, yeah? So I'm defending this pawn. I'm also attacking this knight. I couldn't take here because the queen takes, pawn takes, and I'm pinned. So I couldn't take the. I'm talking about this move. So that's why I played here. Um, now, okay, so I guess I'll take, what else can I do, I mean, it's going to bring the queen here, I can exchange, I can try this, I can check, he goes there, okay, that's interesting, checks there, I go there, I could do this, I guess, but then it doubles the rooks, so instead I'm going to bring my queen here, and try to protect this knight if I can. So it's going to double here, so I need to find a way to protect the knight. And um, I could go there and there, or there and there. So I'm going to try there and there. Now my knight is not pinned anymore, so I can move it next move. And then I can move this rook and attack from here. Okay, I'm going to go there and take this knight if I can. Can I? Actually, I cannot. It goes there. No, that was dumb. That was not very smart by me, I have to admit, because he can go here. I cannot take because queen takes, yeah. And he's threatening this. So okay, I'm gonna try here to exchange the queens, and when he takes, I take with the. Uh, oof, what's going on here? I can still bring my knight back, yeah. I don't think it works, but okay, I was a bit careless. <coughs> Sorry. I try this, okay, now he's not threatening the knight anymore, so I'm gonna go there, try to exchange the queen or something, do something. I was so passive the last 10 moves that now I can breed finally, you know. Okay, I'm gonna come here, and uh, soon soon some checkmate. One, two, three, and checkmate, yeah, like this. I want to control the central square, same thing. Okay, I'm gonna... Actually, I prefer the line with 92. Okay, so here you can trade. Trading is a one option. I, I want to prefer... Since I'm uh, playing against a lower rated, I'm gonna keep my pieces. To try to confuse the game as much as possible. I don't want to simplify anything against lower rated. I want to keep it as complicated as possible. I'm going to go c4, probably going to go b3. Especially now I'm going to go b3 and bishop b2 because I have this long diagonal. It's going to be pretty good, I think, for, for my pieces. I'm going to bring my knight here. It was not in a good square. Let's hope that he gets uh, to a good square. And actually completely neglected the castle, this guy. I just noticed, yeah. He brings this rook here, so he couldn't castle. And I'm not sure what he's doing. Some kind of weird attack. Doesn't seem too threatening, though. But I'm going to go there. So whenever he takes with this pawn, I have this square from my knight. And this is going to be very... I think it's going to be very dangerous for him. That's for sure. Because all my pieces are going to be pretty good. My minor pieces. My rook is going to be good. This rook is attacking, but behind a 
pawn, so it's like not doing anything. Okay, this is a free pawn. I like free stuff. I don't know if I mentioned it, but I'm really, uh, I really enjoy uh, every anything free. Okay, so I wanna maybe attack, try and start attacking. So I'm gonna go there. I'm targeting this. Ooh, this I didn't see actually. Fascinating, fascinating, fascinating. Okay, I'm gonna go there. Actually, I'm gonna go there and target this pawn. Simply, yeah. Okay, he's attacking. I guess I'm gonna go there. Attacking this pawn, attacking this pawn. Again, my pieces are perfect. My king is safe. His king is in the middle. And his, this rook is kind of active, but this rook is very weak. This bishop is kind of useless. I mean, the whole position is shaky for him, of course. I can take this pawn, it's free. I'm gonna do it. Usually I wouldn't recommend uh, taking pawns in front of your king or there is the or if there might be some discovery, but here is obviously good. I'm taking like this. He cannot take back because this knight is pinned. I can take the rook. If knight takes, I can take the rook. Now I can take here. I can play here. I can go there. There's too many good options. Can I do this? Goes there. I go there. 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 I don't know. Too many good stuff. Too many good stuff. I could go there also. Check. And then there, and then there. Yeah, it's too much things going on. So it's becoming quite tactical, of course. Okay, so my two knights are attacking. There's gonna be this file and this pin on this file. Next move, I'm gonna play rook here, for sure. Um, it still has no discovery. That's what I wanna discover. If he goes there, I can take. If he goes there, the same. So that's what uh, I'm banking on, of course. And now, basically, I'm on the verge of winning. Okay, I actually can win thanks to this pin. Okay, I'm gonna take here, and it's gonna be a double check. Here, check here, check here, double check. And then I can take the rook or this. Or I don't know, I'm just gonna take. So you can see that I have three pieces and a queen against nothing. So right now I wanna take as much of the center as possible. This, this is a weak move because it uh, weakens the light squares here and here. So let me think how do I wanna exploit it. I think I'm gonna start by bringing this knight back. This cannot be a bad move. I'm going to take out this knight. I go there. Okay. So can I even exploit it is the question here. Oh, I could. Like if he goes there. Okay, interesting, yeah. Interesting, interesting. I'm just going to play here. Might go there. No, it's actually, I didn't do a good job finishing him. That's for sure. I didn't do a good job. Okay. I cannot... Uh, what can I say? Can I push? I'm gonna... Actually, I could let him take, which is, would be fun. Can I do this also? Okay, I'm gonna try this. No, this is too much. <laughs> this was a trick. I don't wanna play tricks. I wanna uh, learn you some stuff, guys. Sorry for this. Basically, if he takes, I take here, check, then uh, king has to move, and then uh, I take here. That's why I played this, but he didn't fall for it. I mean, he fell for it, because now it cannot castle. But okay, I have only one problem, is that my weak is going to be potentially weak. My king, sorry, is going to be potentially weak, but every, yeah, okay, this, to get this, yeah. Um, it's not very good what he's doing, I think, you can only assume, but I don't think it's pretty good. Because of this king, is, uh, because of this king is uh, much worse, I think, his position. So I'm going to try to exploit his weak king. So there's basically one piece which is not playing is this one. 
and I need to exploit this. So he wants to get, if I go there, he wants to get this with tempo and then get the king here, all right? So I don't want to give him any time, any tempo. So I'm going to bring my bishop here. Oh, I just did it a different way. <laughs> okay, whatever. At least I have this, yeah? Okay, this is a good move, actually. Okay, it's not so easy for me. I really overestimated how easy it would be because this rook doesn't play. I need to play this. Nah, this is not good. Black is better now. So my position is worse because now he can bring his king easily. But okay, I'm going to fight till the end, of course. And I'm going to show the most important thing when you're in bad position, you have to remain calm. You don't need, you don't tilt. That's the way, that's the best way to lose, right? So, okay, the first step, I don't want to trade anything. Now I can take here, take here, actually. But then, wait, take here, take here, take here, take here, here, rook takes here. I'm not a fan of this. I'm gonna bring my uh, king here first. Oh, he might do this. Damn! Okay, I have this now. I'm attacking the rook, so he cannot take the bishop, and I'm protecting this pawn. Whoa. This guy is playing good for uh, 1400. That's quite impressive. I was really not expecting a battle here. But I guess I'm gonna need to be more focused. I'm gonna protect this pawn, you never know. If he's strong, strong player would play this move for sure because he wants to get here, yeah? Incredible. I'm very surprised about this guy. He's playing very well. But I'm tricking him, so it's a good sign that I can still trick 1400s. Okay, I'm gonna bring my bishop here. Maybe he's gonna come here. So I wanna... This pawn move is important. I wanna block any thing anything coming here okay now let me think oh this is a uh, blundered that's good i like blundering i like people when they blunder especially they're more nice i like them okay i'm gonna go there maybe there there this is check ah now it blunders more and more and more and more check here now i'm targeting this he has to i don't know whatever okay i'm gonna try and exchange this nice this, is, it, is it a meme, this knight? Okay, could not allow the exchange. I'm a pawn up. And when you're pawn up, you exchange everything. And you go to a king, same thing. Okay, now if he takes, 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 I, I win, yeah? So, okay, it's gonna be... I have to be quick, but it's gonna be still easy, I think. Oh, I misclicked. My bad. Okay, I have to go here. Which is, which is pretty sad. I don't want to give anything. <coughs> I'm like, so cheap, man. Okay, so, really, man? Okay, so let's uh, copy this guy. And now control the center. Let's go back to principles. Um, we don't want to... Um, let this guy uh, play this move. Usually you shouldn't play back this move. You should just go and play in the center, right? But okay. This guy is going to get spanked for sure. <laughs> Alright. I'm going to go <laughs> here. It's going to go there maybe. It doesn't. Okay, I want to push this bishop away. If he takes, I can consolidate my center. So, important thing you need to know, someone are uh, throwing uh, explosives, I, 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 I think. So a good thing you want to know, in this type of structures, when the pawns are like this, it means you have to attack this way. If the pawns are like this, it means you have to attack this way, right? That's a good thing you need to know, I think. I think it can be important. I think it can help you guys. Okay, so I'm waiting, you know, in chess, there is a saying, I'm waiting him to give you my address so that I can attack. So if he gives him me his address, 
on the king side, I can start attacking. Okay, it doesn't give any address. Is it gonna go queen side though? This is a free knight, my man. If queen takes, my other knight protects it. All right, all right. And now I'm gonna protect this knight. And I push away this bishop for sure. Okay, I can take here, I can push here also, why not? Oh, now takes, takes, takes. No, I didn't see it. He <sighs> didn't see it. So this move h4 was very, pretty useless for him, of course. I, I don't know if he was trying to tilt me, but he also gave the rook. Okay, so he start, he's attacking my bishop. Do I want to be greedy and keep the bishop? Of course. So let's defend it this way. And then go there, takes here, try to checkmate him. This is another free thing. So, okay, I like free things, so I'm going to take it. Okay, so now I want this check. You cannot block because of this. Okay, let's see what's the fastest checkmate. Oh, maybe rook here, takes, check here. Not the fastest. Okay, I'm gonna go there though. Protected by my bishop. It's always dangerous to go to the second square. That's where you attack the, your attack becomes the strongest. Then I'm gonna bring my other rook. And as you can see on my pieces, perfect squares, these pieces are... are the worst. These pieces are the worst, for sure. Oh, I had checkmate. I had checkmate. All right, so I want to control squares. These kids are stupid. So now I'm going to teach you black square concept. The idea is to exploit the black squares around one's king. So I'm going to start with this. This pawn is going to help me in achieving this. So whenever he moves the queen, I'm going to poke this check and I'm going to try to make him give me his black square bishop, right? So now I can take here or go there directly and then go there. Okay, I'm gonna go there and there. That's for sure. I'm threatening checkmate here. And if he goes rook f7, there is a tactic. Can you spot it? If you spotted it, congrats. I wanna take here. He cannot take back because of checkmate, yeah? This is ba basically game over. Because next move I'm taking here. Okay, this is checkmate. So, okay, same principle, we wanna... Okay, so this is a King's Indian. I don't wanna go into theory, so I'm just gonna play the anti-Queen King's Indian. Uh, Gambit decline. Falk beer counter Gambit, all right? Counter Gambit, it's called. That's like, I like the name. Okay, so now it's overprotecting this pawn. I can bring this knight here and then here so that I can put pressure on these two pieces. That's what I'm gonna do. All right, put pressure here and here. Now I can take these things twice. So I'm gonna take this way with this knight. Still protecting this pawn with this knight. <coughs> That's good. I can go there, take, take. I cannot protect this way because, okay, obviously. Can I go there? Check. He pushes. I take, 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 take here, takes, takes. I could. I could. I'm not a fan of it, so I'm just gonna go there. Can take, I'm gonna take, can take, and then I can castle, go bishop uh, g4. We'll see. I just wanna play simple chess and castle. Yeah. I could play g5, but I'm not... I played the counter gambit. I don't want to play any of this.
Okay, so now obviously I want to keep this uh, this pawn. So I'm gonna play here because I need to protect it. Now, okay, I can go there. I think I can keep the protection of this pawn by playing here. This is the only move I can take. I take. Okay, now he is threatening checkmate here. Okay, I'm gonna block that. Also, now I have this for my bishop. So it's not so bad for me, is it? Okay, now I'm happy. Because there, I am take here. Oh, he takes here. Oh, that was bad move then, maybe by me. I'm gonna try to go there, maybe. Because takes, he should take here. Yeah, okay. Can I go there, then he takes? Okay, I'm gonna try this. Okay, I'm gonna go here, protect this pawn. I also wanna go with my king. There, if I can. <clears throat> okay, so I could take here, that's a possibility. I could take this pawn, actually I'm gonna take this pawn. I'm gonna protect this pawn as well, by taking here. If I take here, I can take here. I don't wanna allow him to have more Space, I want to play, place these rooks here and maybe push this pawn, you know? So, by playing like this, now I can take actually. Okay, now I cannot take. And I want to push this. <clears throat> I can push this also, gain more space. Um, I need to think about it. I'm a pawn up. I'm gonna protect this pawn this way. Okay, now I have this now here. It's a progress still, yeah. Do I have this? Takes. So I don't have this. Okay, I wanna exchange more stuff if I can. The more st stuff I exchange, the more. Likely it's gonna be easy to win. I still cannot take, I can go there now. That's tactical actually, guys. I go there. <coughs> he goes there. I take, I oh, takes here. Here, takes, queen takes, takes. No, it doesn't work. I, there works though. Okay, I'll try this. If he takes, 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 I can take. Oh, yes, queen takes, but then I make a queen, yeah. That's what I... Because my idea is to go there, takes, and make a queen as well. And if he takes, 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 I can take here. Okay. That looks good. I don't see any moves for him. Fortunately. Okay, but that's a free... Isn't it? That's a free rook. Oh, and then he goes there. That's his idea, yeah? That's actually smart. Okay, I'm gonna take with the... I'm actually gonna take like this, with the queen. Surprisingly, yeah? When he takes here, I have this check. Very important. Oh, he could have taken the pawn. That's what he should have done. Okay. So now I'm gonna try to be fast. Takes. Here. Back, back to bullet. Back to bullet, guys. Here. Okay, I have to take all this stuff. Quick. Okay, this is pre-moved. No! <laughs> no! Okay, check. Can I go there? Yeah. Okay, the fastest way to checkmate is to make an L around the king. So I'm making an L, and now I can go there. And finally, I can just bring my queen king, you know. So let's, that's our final game, yeah. On here, okay, it goes there. This is um, theory now. 
So I want to protect this pawn. Usually they protect this way. I'm going to play here and knight here and bishop here. So I'm getting all my pieces out. That's what I want to do. Okay, now he's threatening to win this bishop, I guess. I don't want to push here. Doesn't look very strong or appealing. But I guess I'll have to in these circumstances. I'll have to do it. Yeah, okay, he wants to prepare this. Which is, I think, a very decent idea. So I'm going to go c6. So when he goes there, I'm just going to take, yeah. Can go there still. I'm surprised he doesn't go there. It gives me this pawn. Okay, now I'm going to do something different this game. I'm going to attack. Okay. But it's not a good idea. I cannot stress why. I'm, I'm not, okay, what he did is very bad. The reason is that here you should really keep the option, you know, of attacking. Now I'm just going to attack. Bring my king here, bring my rook here, and just push my pawns. That's all I'm going to do. I don't need to do anything else. That's all I need. Okay, I can also win by winning pawns, so that works as well. I mean, he has to play rook here. Yeah, but now I'm winning this pawn. Okay, I'm just going to take the pawn, and I'm actually winning a piece here. Because this is targeted, and when this piece moves, this is hanging. So the defender of this piece get, gets traded, then I just win now. Yeah? Okay. So I didn't have any chance to attack, but okay, it's uh, it's gonna be a win. Uh, regardless, I'm gonna bring my king here. I probably bring a rook here. Can I? I'm just gonna ignore all this. Put a pawn here. Seems good enough to me. I can take. Or I can also ignore. Just gonna bring here and here. Now this knight is pinned, because the rook is behind it. Uh, I might... Okay, I'm gonna try to... This bishop is dead, so we wanna make it alive. That's why I took this way, so that the bishop can have this square, you know? And now this bishop is alive, finally. Then the rook is coming here. There's a fork. I'm just gonna take the first pawn. Okay, now I'm pinning. I could take everything, of course. Simplify is the good is a good way to finish the game. So yeah, we got 